This is the AP News Minute. People across Florida are dealing with massive amounts of destruction from Hurricane Ian. The storm made landfall in southwest Florida on Wednesday afternoon and flooded roads in the northeast part of the state hours later. More than two million people in Florida lost power. Flooding trapped many people in their homes. Hurricane Ian is forecast to move north along the Atlantic coast. Protesters in the country of Georgia went to the border to object to the long lines of people coming in from Russia. The huge exodus began last week after Russia said it would call up 300,000 reservists. Vice President Kamala Harris visited the demilitarized zone that separates North and South Korea. She emphasized the U.S. commitment to the security of its Asian allies, especially after North Korea tested several missiles this week. Donna Water, the Associated Press, with the AP News Minute.